One way to shave time off of your editing workflow in iMovie is to use the up and down arrow keys on your keyboard. Tapping the up arrow will jump the playhead back through the timeline from edit point to edit point. Tapping the down arrow will jump the playhead forward through the timeline from edit point to edit point. Now that may not seem like a big deal, but little editing shortcuts like that save you time in the long run, especially when you're editing longer videos. Not to mention saving you wear and tear on your wrist from mousing all over the place. There's another secret pro level shortcut in iMovie that can really speed up your editing workflow. Well, it's not exactly secret. It's just not terribly obvious. The time saving shortcut that I'm talking about is often referred to as Jackal. Well, maybe I only call it that. Jackal is a way to remember J, K, L, which represent the J, K, and L keys on your keyboard. These keys serve a very cool function in iMovie. The J, K, and L keys help you navigate through your clips, both in the timeline and in the media browser. Now you may be thinking, I already navigate through my clips using the scrubber bar, Mike. Yes, you can, and it works great. But sometimes you can scrub through your footage too fast and you lose track of where you are, which means you have to scrub through again and find the spot you're looking for, which can get repetitive and time consuming. Not to mention wear and tear on your wrist from mousing all over the place. Now, don't get me wrong. The scrubber bar is a great tool for moving through the clips in your project quickly. But sometimes you just want to be able to play through your media to spot in and out points or locate the good parts of your footage. And that's where Jackal, the J, K, and L keys come in. They allow you to play forward and back through your clips, known in editor speak as shuttling. Let me show you how shuttling with the J, K, and L keys works in iMovie. Here on the timeline in iMovie, tapping the L key plays the clip. Tap the L key again, and the clip plays faster. Tap it again, and it plays even faster, and so on, faster and faster, with each successive tap of the L key. Tap the K key to stop playback. All right, going back the other way, tap the J key to start playing backwards through the clip. Tap the J key again, and the clip plays backwards faster. Tap it again and it plays backwards even faster and so on and so on with each successive tap of the J key. Again, tap the K key to stop playback. And that's JKL navigation in iMovie. Now, if you prefer to use the space bar to play and stop your clips, no problem. You can use the space bar with the J, K, and L keys if you want to. And this JKL shuttling function also works on clips in the media browser which I find particularly handy. Navigating through the clips in your project using the J, K, and L keys is a pro-level technique that will help speed up your editing workflow, leaving you more time to be creative. And if you're looking for more ways to take your iMovie editing skills to the next level, have a look at this playlist on my channel.